Okay, let's do this thing! You should join us, Kakarot. Think of the battles you'll have. Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement from the thought? Shut up! If you think I'd ever join you, then you're dumber than you look! I can't help but wonder. That child behind you, is that your son? He, he's not! Yes, that boy indeed has Saiyan blood. It's no use trying to hide it from me. I can see his tail from here. So what if he does? You know, perhaps you need a little time to decide. I'll just borrow your son for a while so you can think over my offer. Take one step closer to Gohan and I'll knock you out! Back off! If you want your little brat return safely, Kakarot, prove your Saiyan spirit. Eliminate 100 Earthlings and pile them here before I return in one day. And let me be very clear about this. If I come back and I don't see a hundred corpses, I kill the kid. What are you doing here? I was pursuing him. And as much as I'd like to kill the wretch myself, the sad truth is I have a better shot at that if you were along for the ride. Hold on, you mean team up with me? Why in the world would you ever do that? Don't get the wrong idea. This would just be a temporary alliance, only for the sake of eradicating that alien off my planet. Once that purpose has been served, I'll keep my promise to crush you. Then I can get back to my plans of world domination. Boma, I need to borrow the Dragon Radar for a bit. Oh, uh, of course. Let's go. Think you can keep up with my flying Nimbus? You gotta be kidding. I'm a cut above the rest of you puny humans when it comes to flying. I thought you'd at least be smarter than this. But you have no idea how 
out of your league you are. Let's skip the pleasantries. We're here to take you down. Simple as that. I'm sorry, brother. I was thinking about my offer, and I've changed my mind. You'd probably just slow the rest of us down. And for betraying the Saiyan race, you will die! Since you're going to be eradicated anyway, let me share a little something with you. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier, they're even more powerful than me. <laughs> you could train yourself for a lifetime and never even come close to their level. But since you were too stupid to heed my warning, you're not going to survive another day anyhow. You've got a new special attack hidden up your sleeve. Now's the time to use it, Goku. <laughs> Sorry, nope. <laughs> Lazy fool. Meanwhile, I've been training non-stop to develop a sure kill technique. For real? Yeah. Only problem is it takes some time to charge up before I can use it. So I'm gonna need you to fight him alone until then, if you can handle it. Gotcha. I'll take care of him. How about this? We're settling this right here and now. Let me show you my full strength. What? Behind you! Whoa! Whoa! Say goodbye, Kakarot! What the? Power level 1,307? Don't hurt my dad! Leave him alone! No, stop! Don't do it! Please, he's just a... Just a child? Is that what you were going to say, Kakarot? Don't worry, brother. You'll see your son again? In the next world? What? You little... P Piccolo! Your attack! Do it now! Ah, are you insane? Maybe, but... It's the only way to beat you! Sorry to keep you waiting. Are you ready? Do it! No! Stop! Special Beam Cannon! On this planet, we have these things called the Dragon Balls. Gather all seven, and together they have the power to grant any wish. Even if it's bringing someone dead back to life. You can all go to hell. Still, I thank you for the information. <laughs> Everything that has happened here today has been transmitted to my two Saiyan comrades deep in outer space. When they've learned that I've been killed, they'll come to avenge me. The other... 
two Saiyans. When, when will they arrive here? How long? One year. Just one short year. <laughs> Damn. T two of them? Even stronger than him? How sweet does that victory taste now? They're going to wipe you all out. They'll soon have you writhing in agony like the worms you are. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> How's it feel, seeing your little friend's corpses scattered all over? There was another one, but there's probably not a scrap of him left. Piccolo's gone. What, you gonna throw a fit, small fry? Go right ahead. <laughs> that stupid look on your face just makes me want to kill you faster. You'll pay for this! You'll both pay! You bastards! Out of my way! Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! What? 9,000? That scouter's a piece of junk! It's gotta be a mistake! It doesn't matter. A little punk like you can't do anything against the mighty Nappa! Body? such a short amount of time! All right! You're the greatest, Goku! Show that muscle head who's boss! Get him, Dad! Whoa! Over here! Whoa! I'm not done yet! Wait! 
He's a psycho! He, he, he just killed his own partner for no reason! Both of you need to get back to Kame House where it's safe! But, Dad, I... No, he's right. You saw what that other Saiyan can do. If we stick around, we'll only be getting in your dad's way! Sorry, Gohan. This guy's stronger than I thought he'd be. We've lost enough. I can't lose you two either. Okay. I understand, Dad. Let's finish this someplace else! Fine by me. Makes no difference. Okay, this spot should do. From what I can tell, there's no people or animals nearby. Interesting. Of all the places on your planet, you chose this as your gravesite. <laughs> you should feel lucky. Not every low-class warrior gets the chance to spar with a super elite like myself. Not long after Saiyans are born, their skills as a soldier are tested. The scum whose scores are ranked the lowest are sent to the outer worlds, where the opponents are weak. Much like you were, Kakarot. In other words, you were cast out like a dog. Yes, and as a result, I was lucky enough to come here to Earth. I'm grateful for that. Besides, even a lower-class outcast can surpass an elite if he puts his mind to it. <laughs> it's a nice attempt at the joke. Now let me show you a wall that you will never have the ability to scale through effort alone!
Open and mix! Huh? What was that? What are you planning? You really should have never gotten rid of your tail, Kakarot. But now you'll learn firsthand what a Saiyan is really capable of. Did you feel that? There's a tremendous energy and it's swelling up even bigger. My dad's energy we're sensing, is it? Something's wrong. I'm going back there. Go on, hold up. I'm going too. Wait. <laughs> Don't blink, Kakarot. These will be your final moments before I crush you! A am I losing my mind? He turned into a giant monkey! This is crazy! How do I fight this thing? <sighs> Since when were we dealing with a hundred foot tall monster? choice now is to gather energy from all over the earth and make a spirit bomb I'll break you. after all this time I get it the monster killed grandpa and the one that destroyed the tournament arena all all of that was was me I owe this to you friends I need to beat this guy, no matter what. I'll have to use every ounce of my energy for the tiniest chance at victory. If I die, I'll see you in the next world. At least I'll get to apologize to you. I'll break you! You won't beat me! Focus to use the spirit bomb. It'll only take about 10 seconds. Come on. 
Give me just ten lousy seconds to concentrate! I think I put enough distance between us. No, you coward! Where are you? Come out and face me! Time's up! He found me! There, it's done! I've gathered energy from every corner of the world! Now! This is the end of the line, Kakarot. Even if you do manage to come back to life, this miserable planet won't be around anymore. Die! <laughs> Consider that. A little farewell present. I, I don't have the strength to lift a finger. So just do what you're gonna do to me, all right? Take your best shot. Damn you, Kakarot! How dare you leave a scar on my beautiful face! Just for that, I'm going to crush you like a grape! <laughs> Why don't I kick it up a notch? <laughs> What's that I hear? Every bone in your body breaking? Must hurt. <laughs> I think your friends are here. How quaint!
The Saiyans are a true warrior race! Don't underestimate us! You were wide open, so I just went for it. Matt, you little punk. Look, you guys have got a choice to make here. Either get off this planet and go home, or you're gonna wind up like your friend here. Did you hear that, Bertha? This jolt knocks out Raccoon with a lucky shot, and suddenly he's dishing out threats to the likes of us. Hmm, he's got some nerve. Let's teach this old punk why the Ginyu Force are the most elite warriors in the galaxy. Let's go! Yeah! This is what happens to morons who underestimate the Ginyu Force. I'm not done yet. I'll dare you! with me for a spirit bomb done this will end it crush that ball So, this is the guy, huh? His power level's only around 5,000. That's him, Captain. Don't be fooled. This freak's way stronger than that. He must be capable of boosting his strength in the midst of combat. From what I can tell, I'd say his true power level is somewhere around 60,000. 60,000? But that can't be. This guy's just a puny Saiyan. It's not unheard of. He could have a natural talent, or perhaps his abilities have been amplified by a mutation like us. Either way, this battle's sure to be interesting. To think I'd find an opponent that I can finally demonstrate my full power on. So, are we gonna dance or fight? <laughs> Have fun, Kakarot! Tatita! This is gonna be good! Yeah. Uh, <laughs> 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 
Getting in, you, sir. I will assist. Damn it. Without Vegeta, this isn't exactly gonna be a cakewalk. I don't remember asking for help, Murder. I'm perfectly capable of fighting my own battles. Butt in again, and it'll be you I pulverize. Understood? <laughs> Your strength is unbelievable. Yeah, I think I'll take it. What do you mean by that? Change now! Guys, listen! That's not me, it's Ginyu! Using my body! Vegeta, why? They couldn't even defend themselves! Shut up! You're too soft-hearted, Kakarot! It's kill or be killed! Now it's time to finish the job! Now die! Fool! Change now! Please let this work! What? Oh no! Bastard! How dare you! You ruined everything! I'm back to being me again! What? What the hell is going on? What does Kakarot think he's doing? I better swap with a fresh body and quick! Yours will do, Vegeta! What in the world? Whew, that was a close one. Now get ready! <laughs> Try to hang on just a little bit longer! I'm on my way, guys! For you to beg me for my help. I can only imagine how hard that must have been for you to do. I may have hated you when you were alive, but I always respected your pride. And now, it's time for me to share that pride. Pride in myself. 
I am a Saiyan that was raised on planet Earth. And in the name of every single Saiyan that you've made suffer, for them and all the people of planet Namek too, I will defeat you! And I would just love to see you try. Both of you, we need to get out of here and quick. We'll only be in the way. Go on! Come on, hurry! Please don't... I don't know if I've ever felt this excited about the prospect of a battle in my entire life. Now I only need to decide how I'll kill you. against placing too much stock in your escape. Though if you like, I can bring you closer to home! I think the brat should go next. You! You! Ruthless! Heartless! Bastard! Go! Take Piccolo with you and get out of here now! Find Bulma, find the spaceship, and go! But... Do as I tell you right now! before I lose what little sense of reason I have left!
His power is expanding even more than his muscles. This really must be 100% of his full power. Doku, are you listening to me down there? Quit standing around and finish him! This is our one chance! It also may be the only chance I'll ever have to fight him. If he really is the strongest being in the whole universe, I need to see if I can beat him myself. What, what did you just say? Goku, listen to yourself! You're out of your mind! There's no point to this! Krillin can't be brought back to life with the Dragon Balls a second time! And I refuse to take the death of my best friend sitting down! Krillin was my best friend. And Frieza took him from me. He killed him in an instant. Like it was nothing! 85% now. 90! Frieza, just know the only reason I'm letting you reach full power is because I want to beat you at your best. With no regrets for either one of us. I know you want the same thing. You're itching to see what your 100% full power is capable of. Otherwise, you would have blown up the whole planet by now. <laughs> the long-awaited 100 times. Yeah! My apologies for the wait. As requested, this is my full power. Then do you want to finish this, or are you just going to keep talking? the irony. He who triumphs loses everything, while the vanquished escapes. I hate to gloat, but there's a lesson here on the virtue of mercy. Its only value is to your foe. We'll see about that. I am Lord Frieza, the most powerful being in the universe. Why? Which is why? You must die by my hand! You fool!
Piccolo, what do you say? Want to train with me and Gohan? I've been raring to fight you again. Sure. Sounds good to me. Krillin, what about the rest of you guys? Thanks, but I'm gonna head to Master Roshi's and train with him, actually. Oh, well, okay. Up there, in the sky! He was attacked from above! There are too many innocent people here! Let's take this somewhere else! You agree to that at least? Many innocent people? Well, that is a problem which can be easily corrected. Stop it! You bastards! It was my understanding you wanted the streets free of onlookers. Evidently, our solution does not please you. That's it! Follow me and we're gonna settle this! If all you know about me is from before I went to Namek, you're about to be in for a real shock! Whoa! Mm. You guys stay out of this. If I'm the one these guys want, then that's what they're gonna get! A most intriguing discrepancy, this dormant power. It departs rather considerably from the data previously compiled. But it is not remotely discouraging. His strength is within manageable parameters. Android number 19 shall now operate as your executioner. Is that right? Fine. Then get over here and fight me! Immeasurable. This Super Saiyan transformation put Goku on a level far beyond us all. <laughs> we'll see. It's no use hiding. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. And now I'm mad! Do not bother, it is futile! 
If I want any chance of winning battles to come, then I need to train hard enough to find a level beyond Super Saiyan. It started. Piccolo's getting ready to fight. Yeah, but who? Do you think it's so? No. Whoever it is, I can't sense their energy. So it's got to be one of the other androids. Stop, Gohan! We can't help it! We're nowhere near their level right now. All we do is slow Piccolo down. <sighs> Dad, that energy! We fell! He's on the move! I'm telling you, there's nothing we can do to help Piccolo with the level of strength we're at right now! <laughs> Come on, Vegeta! What's taking you so long? Perfect form. It's perfect. The Cell Games have officially begun. Now, if any of you should dare to step forward, I would like to kick things off. I'll go first. Well, well. I was hoping to save the best for last, Goku. But so be it. Come on! Whoa! I'm not done yet. There's no way I can beat you. So that's it for me. Anyone. Believe now, my precious little babies. See those seven spectators up there? Kill them all. Oh, and do have fun. <laughs> Guys, keep your guard up. These things are way stronger than they look! Damn it all! I... I'm sorry, guys. I messed up. I didn't think things would end up like this. Yeah! <laughs> 
Time's over. Do as Daddy says and kill them all. Right now. I've killed us. It's all my fault. 
I could have finished him, but I didn't! <laughs> I... I know that look. Sorry, I've thought this over, guys. Well... Any way you slice it, there's only one way to save Earth. Goodbye, my friends. Uh, goodbye? You're not thinking of... Goku! No! <laughs> you did good today, Gohan. You made me proud. Dad, what are you... Tell your mom I'm sorry. I'm not gonna make it home this time. His energy, it's gone without a trace. Take care, okay? Live your lives to the fullest, and I'll see you again when you're dead! Are we back at the tournament arena? What's wrong with you? Vegeta, tell me it isn't true. You let Bobbity's spell take control of you, didn't you? Because doing something like this would make me fight you. It's true, isn't it? If I hadn't gone to these links, we wouldn't be about to fight. I had one day, one measly day in which to beat you, and I wasn't going to waste it standing around on that ship. That was your reasoning? You killed countless innocents to try and repair your meaningless pride? Meaningless? What do you know of meaningless? I don't give a damn about Majin Buu. All I want is my fight with Kakarot. Here and now, I will emerge as the victor once and for all. There's no reason he ever should have bested me. He and I are both Saiyans. But I was royalty among our people. I was a prince, yet he prevailed. He, he even had the impudence to save my life before. And that is an indignity I cannot bear! Bobbity, move us to some place where there's no one else around! I'll give Vegeta the fight he wants, but not here! <laughs> All right then, guess you can find somewhere else. <laughs> Thank you. 
For you to go this far, you must have wanted to settle the score real badly, huh, Vegeta? Can't lie, I get it. This might take longer than I thought. It'll be over soon enough! One, I kill you! I'm not done yet. Sense radical energy back by the others. This Majin Buu creature must be really as powerful as the Supreme Kai was saying. I already told you. The only thing that matters to me is this battle. Everyone else can die for all I care. You're lying. Deep down, I know your soul is still the same, Vegeta. Whoa! You're dead! Give me your best in this fight if you were too distracted. Vegeta! Majin Buu, kill this guy first. Right now! Who hit you first time? Come on, big guy! Why is somebody as strong as you taking orders from a shrimp like Bobbity? Nobody asked for your opinion. Majin Buu is my loyal servant, and he obeys my every command if he knows what's good for him. Give me your energy! It's ready! already tried the golden hair trick, and look what happened to him. Hold on. There's regular old Super Saiyan. Then there's a level beyond Super Saiyan. But further beyond that, I'm not done yet. Let's do this already. 
I'm sorry this took so much longer than the others, but I haven't had as much practice with this one. This is what I call Super Saiyan 3. Goku, I'm sorry, but it's about time we took you back to Otherworld. Right. I understand. <laughs> What's the matter, Goten? <laughs> Goten, honey. Do you want to give your dad a hug before he goes? Aw, oh, was that all? You should have said so, son. Bring it in. Goten? You take good care of your mom for me, okay? <laughs> well, that's it, everybody. I'll see you all on the other side. Oh, no, 
day. I've had just about enough fun for one day. So I'm going to give you ten seconds to say your prayers before I wrap this up. This is bullcrap. You aren't much at all. Let's hope this plan is crazy enough to work. Your strength is truly amazing, Kakarot. You've always been like this, ever since the day I first met you. You were prepared to meet a challenge, even when it was bigger than you were. First, I thought it was your love for Then it was your blind instinct to protect you that spurred you on, and pushed you beyond your limits. And certainly that was a part of it. But over the years, I realized there was more. There's something else in the way you approach a battle. I used to fight for the sheer pleasure of it, sparing no one. I killed the dominant to feed my insatiable pride. But you never fight to kill, or even to win, only to test your limits and become the strongest you could possibly be. You showed mercy to everyone, including me. As if you knew one day I would possess the tiniest sliver of a soul. And here I am, fighting alongside of you. Defy all logic. By some miracle, your compassion has rubbed off on me. And yet I still don't fully understand how you do it. How can you say and fight with such power? And at the same time be so gentle? Perhaps it's my anger that made me blind to the truth for so long. Hang me there, Kekaro. You are number one. <laughs> him off on your own. Just charge your energy all the way and vaporize this monster. Uh, what do you think I've been trying to do? I just haven't had a chance to concentrate. I can't focus my power. It's just so hard when he keeps coming at me. I only need a minute. One minute, that's all. Fine. Then I'll make my stand against him for the next minute. And while he's occupied, you power up. Hey, Supreme Kai's and Dende! Do you hear me up there? If you can, then say something, damn it! Vegeta! I think it's about time we let the people of Earth shoulder the burden for once. The plan is underway. It's time for you to create a spirit bomb. But even if I collect a little energy from all the people who were brought back, it still won't be enough to take down Boo. It won't just be a little bit. You'll get every ounce of spirit energy they can spare. <laughs> you want to use your spirit bomb, Vegeta? Since I call it Goku, I kind of feel like a proud dad. Okay, guys, go set. And you can speak not to just Earth, but the whole universe if you want. That's more like it. Citizens of planet Earth, can you hear me? I like this new side of you, Vegeta. Nice going. 
Here we go. People of Earth, give me your energy. We need you. It, it's ready. And go. Incredible warrior, Boo. It was you against the universe. And you nearly won. I hope you can come back once more, but good. I want to fight you again, one on one, without all the loss. I'll be right there waiting for you, only stronger. Later. You mean you can stay now? We can all be together like a real family? You and Gohan and Goten are back and there's no catch? That's right! I can't wait to get to Mount Pauzu and have some of your good old home cooking, Chi-Chi. Oh, come on, Chi-Chi, why are you crying? I thought it was good news. Let's go, Lord Beerus, you and me! But if I win, you have to leave this planet untouched, deal? Very well, I accept your terms. But know this, none in this universe can hope to match the power of Beerus the Destroyer. I'm not done yet! Uh. Did the Super Saiyan God thing work? I don't know. It sure seemed like it did. But I can't sense my dad's energy at all. Believe it or not, that's good news. The energy that radiates from a god cannot be detected by mere mortals. I will destroy you! <sighs> what a drag. Here we go. This is more than enough for you. You see the difference between us? Whoa! I'm not done yet. My power goes higher and higher! Ka Bay! Ka Bay! Finally, this is what I've been waiting for. <laughs> What do you say we continue this fight on equal footing, God to God? Sounds good to me. I'm only scratching the surface of this new power. That power goes higher and higher! What about you, Beerus? I can tell you're holding something back. Figured that out, did you? <laughs> well, I had a feeling. But you don't have to hold yourself back for my sake, Lord Beerus. 
I'm not gonna get any stronger unless you face me with everything you've got. Yes! Are you always this talkative? You just don't get it. Hey, Vegeta. Sorry, but I've got to run. Ugh, fine. Do whatever you want, as usual. It occurs to me. I suppose I should thank you. Thank me? What in the world for? For years, my every step, my every breath has been motivated by a single desire. Revenge. My new power, strength enough to hold the universe by its throat. It was you who gave it to me. Losing to you, to a pathetic Saiyan. It consumed me. The humiliation was too much to bear. Enough! Get to the point! Ha! <laughs> Impatient as ever. Very well. As a token of my gratitude, I will destroy you first. Would you mind piping down? <laughs> <laughs> I knew it! You've been holding something back, haven't you? That's well deduced for a simpleton. I've held back just like you. Then let's both go all in. No tricks, no reserves. Would you mind piping down? I'm not done. Whoa! Would you mind piping down? All right. Now it's your turn. Let's see this new power of yours. Care to cut to the chase, do we? Very well, then I won't hold anything back either. Brace yourself! Behold my newfound evolution! I know gold's a bit gauche, but I wanted to ensure you grasp my new position atop the pecking order. And for the sake of your feeble mind, let's keep the name simple as well. We'll call this Golden Freezer. Golden Freezer? Farewell, Goku. I can't say it's been a pleasure. I'm not normally one for preemptive goodbyes, but there is a very real possibility that I kill you instantly. And I'd rather be safe than so. You've always been smug, Freeza. But I guess you've earned it this time. Ha! Me! Ha! Me! Ha! <laughs> You fools! Put it better myself.
Sorry I swung at you without any warning, Goku. For a second there, I thought you were someone else. Nah, you were just rattled. Don't worry about it. So tell us, who is this guy? Would you believe me if I said he called himself Goku? What? Me? He wears dark clothes instead of your orange ones, so he started calling him Goku Black. I'll never forget the day he showed up. He said he was going to exterminate the human race. He said he was doing it in the name of justice. I struggled against him for a year after that, but by that point there were hardly any survivors left on Earth. Then, he tracked down Mom just before I came here. Wait a sec. My future self also wrote a message specifically for me. She wanted us to fix the machine and return with you. That means she wants me to go there and beat Kakarot myself! Come on, Vegeta, it's not me! It must be someone who just looks like me! Hey, Trunks! Help me gauge how strong this guy is! Fight me for a while so you can compare my strength to his! Sure. right off the bat, huh? Sounds good to me. I figured this out after you left. I call it Super Saiyan 3. That's incredible. I wouldn't expect anything less from you. In that case, I'll... All right, attack me with everything you've got. Black. Oh, now I see. No wonder I couldn't find you. Hmm. Goku and the Destroyer Beerus. Wow, you really do look alike, huh? How are you, Goku? You're looking quite well. So, we're about to watch Goku versus Goku. It's shaping up to be a fascinating day. This is the finale. stronger than that, right? Hm. I'm flattered you rate me so highly. But I'm getting too much out of this to rush. I'm going all up. Kept you waiting, huh? Ugh. Excellent, Goku. You can hurt me as much as you want. The pain will only make me stronger. Uh, okay, that's a pretty creepy thing to say. Space-time must be dissipating. It's going back to normal.
Uh, it would be your utmost pleasure to please engage in fisticuffs with me, your kindness, sir. All right, let's give it a go. You know, I haven't fought a god since Lord Beerus. You fought a destroyer? No, no. I'm not done yet. So For just a plain old Kai, you're pretty strong. Between the antisocial psyche that's clearly lurking within him and the energy that he's projected outward, I'd say our suspicions that Zamasu is black have been circumstantially corroborated. Then maybe I should just dispense with him now while I can. Hmm? You guys sure about this? You know, he really didn't seem like such a bad guy to me. That's because you're too trusting of people. The energy I felt was similar, but it wasn't exactly the same as Black's. It seems there are more mysteries to solve. If you do anything that Grand Zeno finds insulting, he could easily erase you, me, this entire reality from existence. Don't forget that. One more thing, Whis. If Grand Zeno does lash out, make sure it's not its Supreme Kai. I need him protected at all costs. So, what's going on with you? What do you want? I'm not asking much. I just want a friend, you see. You're not like most people. You're fun. I want you to be my friend, Ogie Dogie. 
We can do that, I guess, but is that the only reason you called? Is that a problem? Of course not, Grand Zeno. Goku would feel privileged to be your friend and provide you unsurpassed joy. You be quiet. I'm sorry, Zeno, but actually now's a bad time. There's something I've got to take care of, but when it's done, we can play, I swear! So once you're done with your busy thing, you'll play with me? Sure! And if you want, I can bring somebody else who'd be even more fun to play with, too. So the next time, you won't have to wait on me. Really? Okay, it's a date! Go on, Goku! Rejoice! Only through me will you finally reach the pinnacle of beauty you have sought for so very long. You know, I don't know what you're rambling on about. Father! Your mind is too small. Your mind is incapable of understanding the grandeur of my success and the glory of my cause. It's like staring into the sun. You cannot see. The vast beauty of my being overwhelms you. For I am the breed of art and divine. That's enough. Samasu! I thought you were decent, but you're scheming with black! Scheming? Such a negative word. We are more like comrades on a righteous crusade. I'm not done yet. Break through the limit! Use an extra hand. Yes. Come now for the plan. It's fate. No, no. Break through the limit. Whoa! <laughs> 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 
I'm not done yet. I've been keeping this one a secret. Going all over. Break through the limit. My wait is almost over. Soon the world I've been dreaming of for so long will be made manifest. A truly just and perfect utopian existence. This is the planet's position. What? Mortals are unnecessary. And more than that, unwelcome. Hate to burst your bubble, but there's no way I'm letting you two get what you want. This time I'll fight. How disappointing you ungrateful and barbaric creatures are. The gods gave you minds capable of true wisdom, yet you wasted on self-interest and war. you talk about the values of mortals after everything you've done to my world? Final Flash! You think you got him? What? It can't be! I've taken godhood to a new level. Divinity made perfect. With a body that befits a Kai. One that is invincible. I can already tell I'm going to be sleeping soundly tonight. This is your end. Say it. Who's there? It seems we've returned to a future where there is no black. My world didn't change. I knew it. Beerus couldn't fix this. Not even the act of a god made a difference. We know the truth! All the terrible things you've done! We know you use the Super Dragon Balls to get your power! You think I'm a copy? Oh, you're wrong. This is Goku's actual body, down to the last battle scar. The perfect war machine. I took the Time Ring and found the Super Dragon Balls. Then, with my first wish to the dragon, I switched bodies with you, Goku. Okay, so if you're telling us you're Zamasu, then who's this guy who actually looks like him? From your world's perspective, I'm the Zamasu from this world. And I work for justice with the Zamasu from the past. You haven't worked it out yet, Goku? I'm none other than the Kai once called Zamasu. The god defeated by a mere mortal. You. But how can that be? I saw Beerus destroy you. He said you'd be gone. Old Beerus clearly doesn't understand the full beauty of this time ring. Wearing it protects me. Not even what a god did in the past can affect me. Thanks to the time ring, I could empower my new ally without waiting at all. We collected the Super Dragon Balls in the future, and wished again. You are willing to kill your Supreme Kai just to get that ring? Yes. 
Then we had to make sure no one would undo our accomplishments later. So we found the Super Dragon Balls once more and shattered them. After that, we had to keep the other gods from interfering here. I used your strength to kill every other Kai in this multiverse. That means in this timeline, there are no more gods who can stop us. We have all the power. The two of us alone! This destruction was unfortunate, but necessary to achieve our virtuous goal. The Zero Mortal Plan. Mortals are a foolish and ugly mistake that stain the majesty of the cosmos. By eliminating all mortal creatures, we can reclaim this perfect creation. We've already cleansed a great number of planets of their repulsive mortal blight. Your filthy kind is worst of all. How many times have conflicts nearly destroyed this planet and threatened to spread across the universe? Because you are the ugliest, we are sentencing you to the heaviest punishment. A despair and terror that befits your wicked crimes. And none of you will escape it. This is it, Saiyans. For the sake of our most glorious project, you will die today. Cannot keep up with me. Sure, you would have asked by now, Goku. Aren't you concerned about your family? My family? Where does one begin such a gripping tale? After I collected the Super Dragon Balls and switched bodies with you, I went to Earth to check, to make sure we had really switched. And there I found you. You were shocked to find yourself in my body, and your family was terrified. Damn you! What about Chi-Chi? And Goten! Oh, sure, you can guess that much, Goku. You monster! You pay for that! You took my body! You took my life! And then you even killed Chi-Chi and Goten! Hm. You regret telling me that, Zamasu! Now I'm mad! Now I'm really, really mad! And now it's time to pay! Thank you, Goten. Your anger feels simply incredible! Now, you face my blade.
There will be no more retreating. Now you're trapped here. So this world will be the last you ever see. For a god, you're surprisingly confused. This isn't going to be our final resting place, it's going to be yours! We were even going to bring you a casket, but we couldn't find one small enough. Our master Goasu and the other Kais were foolish enough to believe mortals could be entrusted with intellect. So, Kakarot, where are you keeping that jar? Oh, crap! It was still in the time machine when they blew it up! How could you be that stupid? Fine. What's done is done. I'd rather win with our fist than some magic trick anyway. <laughs> I was just thinking the same thing. <laughs> Better keep your focus on me! Mortals do not tell gods what to do! This was just the start. I channeled my divine rage into power. I have forged a new instrument with which to destroy you. This side will carve a reminder into your mortal flesh of the strength of my divine wrath! <laughs> Just as we foresaw, fighting this formidable Saiyan Blight has carried us both to new heights. This proves our transformative power. Our destiny is to cast judgment upon all creation. Hold it! Perhaps. Yes. <laughs> What's the matter, mortals? Relax. Don't be afraid. I thought you Saiyans love fighting the strongest. Hey. Shall kneel before our radiant. Justice Get together! Thus begins a new. Here we go! Show your reverence and bow down before our splendor. Worship. Give praise unto me. Me the beautiful, the sublime, me the invincible. The Almighty and Divine. All hail, Samus. Trumps, keep Bulma safe! Right! Here we go! So I'm not done yet. This is a Goku, Vegeta, are you all right? Yeah, we're a little banged up. But I think we're okay, at least for now. Ka me ka me ka After fusing, he now possesses indestructibility and Saiyan strength. How can you surpass that? Who knows? But no matter what, I will make him pay for everything he's done. With you all the way, Vegeta. I don't care about the odds. We won't stop until he's defeated. Take this! 
world and for all of us mortals i'm putting all of our hope into this one blast gallic gun come on trunks give it all you've got right i've had enough of you impudent mortals away with you summer Shall smite the heart of the wicked. Face my divine wrath. Ah! Blasphemous fool! You continue to defy a god. Half of this combined Zamasu came from Black. It seems the part of his body that's vulnerable to attacks is affecting the part that isn't. Okay, Vegeta. It's time. We're gonna fuse. Just like them. Don't, you can't be serious, clown! There's no way I'm going to do that again! I don't like this any more than you do, Vegeta. But if we still need a major boost in power to break down his body, then this is the best chance we've got! Come on! You gotta admit I'm right about this! Good luck, you two! Thank you! It's now or never, Vegeta! There's something I've always wondered. When we fused last time, the Kai said it was permanent, but we split apart anyway. Do you know why? The truth is, it's only permanent if a Supreme Kai is involved. Otherwise, it only lasts an hour. So just a one-hour battle, then we're back to ourselves! Cut it out! If you say one more word, then the answer's no! Damn it all! One hour, but that's it! Vegeta, I need your help, just one more time. So I swore I'd never merge bodies with you again. All right! <laughs> Who are you? You two doubled up, so we did the same. You know, just to play fair. We're a merge fight, the combination of Vegeta and Kakarot. Vegeta! And here's something new. Vegeta Blue! That was cool. Get ready for this. You're more powerful. But you're still not a god! Okay, what do you say we wrap this up? Oh, I'm sorry, is this hurting you? You aren't a purely invincible god anymore. And you can never get the number of mortals down to zero now. You see, now that you've merged, you've taken in something that's always going to be a part of you for as long as you live. Goku's mortal and destructible body. Final? Kamehameha! Get me. 
that Goku's body will always be part of me. Of course you will. Such was my desire. You are mortal sins. If you've gained divine power, you're stronger than the most deities now. Saiyans are the ultimate symbol of the failure of the Kai's. Not by taking Goku's flesh into my field, I have assumed. Hmm? It hasn't been an hour yet. It's not about gods and mortals. You don't believe in anything but yourself. And we won't let you win! I can feel it. Keep it coming, guys. Share your power with me! Supreme Kai, tell me, do you think the Zeno of this timeline is still around? Yes, there's no question. Of course he would be. No one can defeat Grand Zeno. It's impossible. All of existence, go away! Mark my words, we're gonna win that tournament of power! All right, let's gather the 10 strongest fighters we know to make sure we beat the other universes. Sure thing, I'll head out now. Something for you. 
for you. This is everyone's power, the spirit bomb! You know, you really do have a remarkable talent for fighting, Boo. Wait, I know, Frieza! That's who we should get! He can be the 10th fighter for our team! At last, the arena is finished and the teams from all competing universes are here. We will now hear some words of welcome from the Omni Kings themselves. Thank you all! This will be so fun! We've been looking forward to this very much! So fight well, and give us a good show! Poetry, thy name is Zeno. Thank you, your majesty. For those who neglected to pour through the rulebook assiduously, I'll lay out the basic guidelines. The battle will last 100 tacks. That's roughly equivalent to 48 Earth minutes. Special techniques are allowed, but the use of weapons is prohibited, as are any lethal attacks or maneuvers. You must throw your opponent off the ring to win. Lastly, regardless of how wounded you may be, the use of restorative implements is expressly forbidden. And that concludes our review of the rules. Let the Tournament of Power begin! All right, hope you're ready. It's Goku, right? I've been wanting to talk to you. Powered up into a kind of Super Saiyan I've never seen before. Show us how, and we'll thank you by using it to beat everyone here. Starting with you! Kaliba, that's no way to say thanks! Well, I'm not sure either of you rookies are ready to handle that kind of power yet. Rookie? If that's what you think of us, then you got another thing coming. Let's show up, Kale! At least you're entertaining. I'll give you that much. <clears throat> Don't worry, I'll back you up! I hate to ask, but this is our fight. Can you stay out? I'm sorry. I'm not done yet. We face everything together. Khalifa, you don't think I'm interfering. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> 
okay? But I can barely feel a thing. Someone Grotesque! Is that her idea of going Super Saiyan? That's incredible! I'm glad you're showing us what you're really made of. Careful, Kakarot! Don't get sloppy! Relax, I won't. We don't know what we're dealing with. That could be the legendary Super Saiyan form our ancestors spoke of. Seems it's my turn. <laughs> Yo, Jaren, let's do this, you and me. A Saiyan. Medium. I'm not done yet. Break through the limit. Yeah! <laughs> 
this to hypnotize people. How is our team? <laughs> they appear to be holding up all right. One way or another, they're all staying strong in the face of this assault. Yep, China! <laughs> no hard feelings! Yeah. 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 
<laughs> it seems my love is too much for you to handle. Wait a minute. What are you doing, Goku? I don't need your help. That's good, because I didn't come here for that. I saw those guys had you backed into a corner. Listen, Goku. The one with the ears is mine. Don't get in my way. Oh? Well, you're free to try and stop me. You're pretty fast, aren't you? But I've got my own tricks, silly rabbit. Damn it, he's too fast for me to use instant transmission. Wait. Man, how did he already know what I was gonna do? Sure, you got speed on your side, I'll give you that. But your moves are simple and predictable. Once I get the timing down, it'll be easy. It doesn't matter who I'm up against. What just happened? I flex my muscles the same way that I do before a time skip, just so that I could lure you in. Perk up those ears and listen carefully. Challenging me? <laughs> Fine by me. Goku! It's Master 
Roshi! Try again. Whose power is that? Well, well, well. It appears that outrageous monster's finally joining the fray. My ally, do what you feel is required. Do whatever fulfills your desires. Fight so that you may claim the Super Dragon Balls. So, you finally decided to fight me after all this time. That's nuts! Yes, who would have thought that one mortal warrior could release this much energy? Jiren defies common sense. He cannot be defeated. The power of his foe doesn't matter. Take this! I have a full appreciation of your strength now. And that's convinced me to use something I've been holding back. Gonna have to use the spirit bomb! But I'm gonna need a lot more time to gather enough energy! Take however much time you require. If this is your special move, then I want it done right. Goku! You can take our energy too! Jiren! Once you're out, I hope you don't regret giving me the time to finish this. Got a little something for you! This is everyone's power! The spirit bomb! is what it looks like when the seventh universe unites! This is our spirit bomb! Seriously? Impossible. He's pushing it away. Dad's not done. He can power up and push back. Kaioken times ten! Kaioken times twenty! The spirit bomb has never failed us before! It's over, Jiren. Victory is yours. Goku, is that it? Here it comes. Something's different about him, that's for sure. Yes, I'm sensing an incredible strength from him, and yet... His energy is so calm, it gives me the creeps. Let us watch and see what happens. After all, this is the first time even I have seen Goku in this curious state. It's amazing. I've never seen my dad move like this before, not in any form. Yeah, his dodges are like that, too. What the hell's going on? Kakarot, what have you become? This is the end for you! Ooh, Goku has become so much stronger now! Goku, you got much stronger very suddenly! Yes, much stronger and much more amazing, too. It's so wonderful! Oh, I hoped for this! 
but I have to admit, I wasn't sure if the Saiyan would ever be able to achieve it. Autonomous Ultra Instinct. It can't be. It's impossible. That's an extremely elite level of power, difficult for even the highest gods to reach. In this marvelous cosmos, wonders really do happen, don't they, my lord? He's now in uncharted territory. It remains to be seen what will happen to him. Matters not. He can no longer fight. Interesting enough for you anymore, huh? Let's go! You and me, Goku! First hit was knocked out of the ring, and now Kaba's gone too. I have to get stronger so I can keep fighting in their place and give our universe a chance! So show me how to get to the next level. I don't have time to wait. I need to get to Super Saiyan 3! Okay, sure, why not? But I can only show you if you try to defeat me with everything you've got. Don't patronize me. before you fight for real. Yeah, you're right. I hate that too. Kept you waiting, huh? When I first met you, I never expected you to get so powerful, Polyglot. I'm starting to think you can reach Super Saiyan 3 now. Maybe beyond. Hey, how about you? You game? Yeah, let's go! We'll get to three together! Fight! Ah! 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 
So you know what we need to do, don't ya? Of course! You'll charge in and I'll follow your lead, Kalifla! Like hell you will! We do this as equals! With the two of us fighting together, we're the toughest force in the cosmos! You're damn right! before this battle starts. What? Are you sure? Knocking both those Saiyans out at the same time. <gasps> what? You're kidding me! This is Kale plus Kalifla! We're Kepla! Used with Pataras. I didn't see that coming. Hey, it's about time. I've been waiting for this. And I guess I'll have to crank it up. I'm just getting started. This time, Goku. We fight for real! I'm not done! Struggling this much in that form, then you're clearly still running on fumes, Goku. Even if I am Kefla, you won't surpass me. me. Yes, maybe I'll turn blue myself. You want to see that? <laughs> if you can, go for it. Oh, trust me, I will. Right after I show you who's boss. Here we go! Come on, Kefla! The real fight starts right now! Yeah, I can see that. Damn it, you're awesome! I couldn't ask for a worthier challenge. Beating you's gonna feel great! I'm gonna mess you up real good! Don't underestimate Saiyan! Goodbye! It's faint, but I can sense their presence. Go! Got you! I'm just getting started! Break through the limit! me! I'm just getting started. Go 
Shoku! No! This... this isn't over yet! Look at the form he's taken. That glow! Well, this time I'll make sure to soak it up. <laughs> Autonomous Ultra Instinct. I won't be outdone by anybody. I'll just up my own game too! With Goku's threat making her think she either had to win now or be removed from the tournament, she has found an even greater extreme of power. There is no such conquering weapon as the necessity of conquering. Looks bad. If one of those rays hits Goku head on, it could be the end for him. Is she planning to burn through all her energy to knock him out? Not bad, but you can't dodge in midair. Well then, Universe 2 and Universe 6 have been eliminated. Bye-bye! What is that monstrosity? They just built something big to try to frighten us. But if I were scared, would I be laughing? <laughs> His power is incredible. We don't have much of a choice, but I don't think we can stop him unless we all fight together. You don't have to tell me. That's obvious. Let's move in fast from different angles to confuse him. Then we'll all attack at once. Take this! What do you say you help us fight this guy? Are you going to say please? Win this for us, all right? Contestant 18 has been eliminated. That brings the seventh universe down to five warriors. With 18 out, we'll all have to fight even harder. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. Okay. Let's do this! Break through the limit! Only a sniveling coward abandons their pride! It's stunning you could find so much power without sacrificing your ideals. You fought hard to defeat Tavo. Well done. There's something I'd like you to see.
What is this guy? Some kind of monster? Hmm. I never would have guessed he was holding back this much! Jiren's power is unbelievable! He's in a league of his own! How are Goku and the others supposed to compete? Your little brains are gone. You're finally getting serious. Vegeta! <laughs> Come now. Don't be foolish. You have no chance against me, especially in your current form. Don't you shrug me off! <laughs> Seeing that rib in your snazzy outfit makes it all worthwhile. You will suffer! <laughs> You're wide open! Here we go! Break through the limit! Now the burden of weakness falls upon you. Goku! Vegeta! No, come on, guys! What's he doing? Has he gone mad? At least get yourself out of the way! Hey! Goku! Vegeta! I'm giving up my dream of that cruise. You owe me. There. I bought you some time. Sacrificing myself to help other people. Look at me, being all human. Even if I'm not the one who does it, even if I'm not the one who delivers the final blow, as long as the universe wins, it's fine by me. Yeah. Vegeta, I'll get you that wish. This is the last thing I do. So he entrusted his energy to you. More foolishness dressed as valor. Trust provides nothing but a path to the grave. Come on, Jiren! Stop lying to yourself! So, is that pitiful display the most you can do? I'm standing here because Vegeta and the rest of my team trust that I can find a way to pull this off! I win because I refuse to let them down! I won't fail! Kakarot! Go, go, go! go. go.
look at him. He's like a new fighter. It's like the first time he fought Jiren, and when he fought Kefla. I'd say that this match is about to get a serious shakeup. He cannot afford another misstep. I'm quite sure this will be his last chance. Each time he defies his physical limits and forces himself to fight like a god, the strain on his mortal body increases. He has already pushed himself so far, and with no more allies to aid him, he cannot hope to recover again. If the glimmer fades from his eyes, it'll be over. With his incomplete Ultra Instinct, all he's doing is delaying the inevitable. You called it incomplete, which implies he hasn't fully mastered it yet. Don't tell me you're stupid enough to ignore the obvious implications of that. Are you suggesting that he can master Ultra Instinct in the time that he has left? Please. <laughs> you're a fool. That's impossible. 48 minutes. That's all we were given for this tournament of power. Yet in that brief time span, we Saiyan warriors have shattered our limits. Time after- Jiren's attacks are intensifying as well. He's got Goku pinned down. Quick, Goku! Get out of there while you still can! Hurry up! No more talk. Just shut your mouths and watch. Something beyond my strength's limit. <laughs> Goku seems even more amazing than Jiren now. Yes, now he is super, super, super amazing. Indeed, sires. He has arrived at something truly superb. Please? Goku's done it, hasn't he? He's finally achieved it. Yes. It's astounding. This mortal really is something else. Look at that brilliant form. There can be no doubt. This is Autonomous Ultra Instinct. Energy is climbing even higher. Tell me how. How you stand up no matter how many times you fall. Answer me, Goku! Because Vegeta here had 17 and all the others gave everything they had. Keep going! If I do quit, I betray that trust. And I refuse to let all of them down. It's useless! Your ideals mean nothing in the face of my power! You say they don't mean anything. I'll show you that they do! That should be obvious. Goku can reach these heights because he's not just fighting for himself. He fights for all of us. That's the difference here. Piccolo is right. Behind every one of Goku's strikes is a whole community of people who've grown up with him, strengthening him over a lifetime of unimaginable challenges. 
Each one has been crucial, inspiring and pushing him forward. Goku doesn't imagine for one minute that he's gotten this far on his own. He's pushed all of us forward too, shaping us into the people we are today. Even as he fights his opponents, he has a funny way of drawing them in. That's just the kind of man Goku is. This is our power, Jiren! <laughs> to hell with your friendship! To hell with your trust! Putting faith in such things would mean denying all that I've witnessed in my life up until now! I know better than to believe in that so-called strength! I know how easily it's ripped away! Go on, Kakarot! Now it's time to put Jiren down! Goku's looking pretty useless now. We're gonna have to handle this ourselves. Yes, obviously. What are you doing, Jiren? Kneeling down at your enemy's feet? Is this honestly the way you want your fight to end? Get up! Come on! Why would you spend all those years honing your strength, rejecting everything and everyone else, just to surrender? Keep fighting to the end! Sorry about that, you guys. I didn't mean to leave you like that, but I got this. How the hell are you still standing? I don't need to share the limelight with you either, monkey. The three of us need to do this together to get this done, or our universe is doomed! So, Goku, once again you have returned, and once again you will Don't you, Goku? To bring me back to life? Seriously, Frieza? Will you keep your word or won't you? As long as you hold up your end of the bargain and help us win, I'll hold up mine. You should know that better than anyone by now, don't you think? Hmm. That sickening naivete of yours is what I quite despise most of all. But for my own self-interest, I should probably thank you. You guys done yet, or you want a hug first? Nothing would repulse me more. Got a little something for you. This is everyone's power, the spirit bomb. Can ah! ten times ten? No, I'm twenty. To get my hat together. Sure could learn something. And the way you fight. I need you to throw me! 
me say it! You got it! One alley you coming up! Secret of the seventh universe! The power of trust! Whoa! Way to go, Frieza! Silence! Don't make this worse by thanking me, Saiyan! I need no other gestures as long as you keep your word to me, monkey. You got it. Consider it done. Contestant Jiren is eliminated. The Eleventh has been defeated. They will now be expunged. Jiren! I know we just barely finished the battle of our lives, but I'm already hungry for the next fight. Maybe you don't want to hear this. But I feel like we've gotten stronger together, and I think that's worth a lot. I hope to see you again, Jiren. <sighs> what an incredible warrior. Yeah. I will. Keep it real, Zennies. <laughs> yeah. We'll never stop getting stronger, right, Vegeta? Of course we won't. Only a fool put limits on the strength of a Saiyan race. <laughs>